are, you, it can be endless, you know, it's about the shape of it, you know, if you look at this collection, the asymmetrical, whether it's just beaded or in a double-faced satin, I think that exaggerated waistline, and that's really what really keep it more dramatic and, and glamorous in the size of the, the pleating. We use a lot of tool, organza. It's a shape is bigger, but in terms of just the way you look at it, it's flowy. The organza is its movement to it. What's so important for the bride is not just to say what is today. What is this dress is going to look on a photograph later on? So she really have to keep in mind that it has to have classic in its base, but a touch of trend. For example, for Kenneth Poole, when we use feather, feather is in trend right now in ready to wear. So I used it in bridal, but still has to really look like a wedding dress. And I like to use color, but color that a bride actually can wear. This is more antique, like more a butter color, but within a family of bridal coloration. I really want brides to really wear it as it is because it looks like a wedding dress, have some color to it, it's much more fun and it's different. It's more important to her that she walks in, it is dramatic and, and, and everyone notices her. She does not worry about the dress has been heavy or not. That's not in her mind. Make me something glamorous and I wear it and that's what I designed for her.